Today in English, we will work towards improving our language skills. We will be learning the use of the verbs am, is, are. Now children, observe this picture carefully and let us read the given passage that is related to this picture. My name is Rohan. I am in class 2 at Royal School. My parents are very good at their work. Rover is my pet dog. He is white in color. He is quite big. On Sundays, we are all at home. I like it when we are all together. Now, children, you would have noticed that the words am, is and are have been Underline in this passage. We use am, is, are to talk about naming words or to say what they are or where they are. For examples, I am in class 2 at Royal school. Rover is my pet dog. My parents are very good at their work. Now you can see children am, is and are are highlighted in red color. Now let's see how do we use them and when do we use them. We use am with I. Like you can see in the first sentence, I am in class 2. So, I is used with am. So, or in other words, you can say you use am when you have the pronoun I. We use is with he, she, it and naming words that are singular. So, we use is with singular naming words, that is, naming words that are one in number. We use are with we, you, they and naming words that are plural. So, I is used with we, you, they and also with naming words that are plural in number. So, we they are always plural in number. You can sometimes be plural, sometimes it's singular. When you're pointing out to one person, you, it can also mean many. Now, just to revise what we just did, I is used along with am. Or should I say, am is used with I. Is is used with he, she, it and singular naming words. Are is used with we, you, they and plural naming words. Now children, look at these three pictures. Now, let us read these three sentences. The first one. I am a student. Second, he is a driver. Third, they are doctors. Now in the first picture, you are talking about yourself. That is I. So, am follows I. The verb that follows I is am. So, I am a student. He is a driver. Singular noun, he. 
And for plural, that is doctors, it is are. So we read it as they are doctors. Look at the pictures and circle the correct verbs. Now here you can see a picture. Let's read the sentence here. Now you have got all the three verbs here. Am, is and are. You have to choose which is the correct one and circle it. Let's take the first sentence. It. Now we have to find out the verb. A hot day today. Hot day. So day is singular. And it is also singular. So which verb do you think children should come in here? Well, yes, it is is. So children, you will be circling is. Here you have a basket of fruits. Let's read the sentence. The fruits and is are are the three options in the basket. Now fruits is the plural form of noun. So, which verb should come here? Well, yes, it's R. So, you will circle R and you will read the sentence as The fruits are in the basket. Here we have some children. We am is our children. Again, children is the plural form. So, the verb R is right. So, we read the sentence as, we are children. So, you will circle R. Here you can see a child is eating food. I and is are are the three options. Eating food. I is singular. So, which verb should follow I? I am. So the sentence reads as, I am eating food. You will circle am. Here we have a postman. He am is are a postman. He means singular. So he is a postman. So you will circle is and you will read the sentence as, he is a postman. Here we have a girl. I am is are a girl. Which verb follows I? Am. So you read the sentence as I am a girl and you circle am. The next question write am is or are in the blanks. The first one my name dash Anita. Anita is one person. So what should come here? Is. So it will be my name is Anita. I dash at home now. Which verb follows I? Am. So you read it as I am at home now. They dash my friends. Friends means more than one. They also means more than one. So they are my friends. My parents dash hardworking. Parents means mummy and daddy. So more than one which means it's the plural form. So once again you get the verb are you. So you read the sentence as my parents are hardworking. India dash my country. Our country is only one in number. So India is my country. I dash seven years old. I am seven years old. So children, you will complete these two activities in your English notebook. Thank you.